episode 20 of the Justice League animated series I'm about to end this first season I can't wait to watch this season 2 on it so let's get into it hmm. I actually thought of green art when I saw those edges very soon The love, of course, the love of my son, Camelot's new ruler. Oh, Camelot, you ain't Camelot. We are betrayed! For Arthur, for Camelot! <laughs> Art thou satisfied, villain? For thy base treachery, Camelot will fall this day. Oh, is that a million? Yeah, it's Mary. Not a man, and have never known the sweetness of a woman's kiss. A viper's kiss, Jason Blood. The kiss. Night of Shadows. Don't panic. That's where it is. The stone. What? Detective Batman. Is a philosopher's stone. According to legend, it was a gem from the hilt of Excalibur and the true source of the sword's fabled power. Hello, dude. I assume you're not here to grow. <laughs> Yeah, Superman ain't gonna fight, you know, she use magic. Somehow, Superman is, you know, weak to magic. At last, Merlin's Ark, the repository of the Philosopher's Stone. She's been here, but she doesn't have the stone. Yet, how can you be sure? Oh, he's just in blood, okay. Get down! Jason, the door! This is the way you call swimming. And I'm Batman. Gone, gone, the form of man. Rise the demon enter again. Warn me. <laughs> that witch will pay for this. I'll feast on her cold heart. If the stone's as powerful as you say, we're going to need help. Yeah, because I've got my friends who are so powerful. In an unending game of cat and mouse. For the past generation, she has hidden from me. But I'll never rest until her soul burns. Is it him? No, a mere amateur. He has no idea who he's dealing with. Every time, this always happens to Joan. Every time. Because now on a mask. Can't you? John. My Leah. Well. We thought we lost you, buddy. Then it was all an illusion. Yeah, it was an illusion, man. You should know that. Lay off, gruesome. John, 
Are you all right? Yes, of course. I'll keep quiet. Did you locate Lafay? As I asked you. You think of him as a carrot in front of your nose. She will give you everything you dream of. But only until she gets what she wants. The voice of experience. Mm. Oh, yes. Don't say I didn't warn you. I understand where he's coming from, though. He has been in that situation. Youth is so wasted now. What did you do? Give me a heart attack. He's in shock, but he'll recover. Why bother with him? He'll pass on in a few years. Ash. Let's find Mr. Hickman. Stand aside. Hey, quit shoving! No cuts! Yes, we're by heroes. Sorry, official world saving business? Are you on the list? This is an emergency. We are with the Justice League. <laughs> sure, lady. So are they. Just a kid in him now. Can they do this? Now get back in line. You stupid little man. <laughs> Security! We've got a situation here! This is gonna get messy. Wait. Oh yeah. The man likes what he sees. How could I deny such a goddess? Oh, well, he doesn't like this. I'm with her. Lafay may not know that Moss doesn't have the stone. Still so bitter, my love. John. John. Dude. Contrary yourself. Contrary yourself, me. What we seek is obviously not here. No. Why are you fighting him? Harpy still has a clause in you. You betrayed us. No. Leave him alone. Batman. Admit it, Martian. You let her get away, didn't you? It's all your fault. I said this episode caught me by surprise. Not exactly what I expected it to be, but I could see this actually going for a three part episode because this season, you know, at least this last episode, there are like three of them. So if they are like to divide each episode that is into two parts, it doesn't really make sense because the last episode would be like, you know, a little bit long, like 40 minutes. So can see this is doing like a three-part episode now going back to the episode i think it, it they really did a great um amazing job actually you know establishing the story especially i did not expect a story from the justice league to be about Arthur or anything like that you know or camelot you know this episode is, is basically about camelot and the, the things that really happened Back in the day at Camelot, so this woman really wants Madrid. If you watched or at least read the books about Camelot, Madrid was also in that book, you know. So this woman wants his a son to be the king of Camelot, and he still wants that. Like it's been years since Camelot, you know, since those events really happened, and now we're in the present day, and she still wants that, really. How long are you gonna do this? Until your son is king, king of what? There's no more kings now this time. 
the like president so i really don't understand the motive but i guess it's like on the bigger scale she his son his son gets him to be king everyone else better follow king is rules you know otherwise they could punish punished or and something like that i guess that's their plan really you see but really what they did this episode and just explain at the same time exploring john jones's past you know this thing what he wishes you know at least about his family and everything that happened to him it's really amazing and i really want to this to see john jones actually use his mind control powers and actually win for once able to overcome this feeling of just being you know every time he fights to somebody he's always losing when it comes to mind control so i really want him to abrogate this powers be able to control this force of you know just mind controlling and be able to just achieve or overcome this everything that she is seeing you know i want him to overcome it and actually win against this i think that's the reason why they're doing this party you know as a story a sad story so i really want to see how that goes and that being said i really don't know what is going to happen in the next episode i think that's the best part about watching this episode you can't really predict what is going to happen next in the next episode and that's what you, you should feel when you watch a series a movie or anything you shouldn't be able to just you know predict what's going to happen in the next yeah some feet some movies are still great even though you know how uh it's going to happen in the next but it's the way they execute the things that makes you like okay this was really amazing the way you did it this makes it you know amazing so i hope the next episode is really amazing and it's kind of that feeling you know so that being said guys thank you for watching my video i'll see you in the next one goodbye